and subscribe in the next five seconds or this spider will be in your bed tonight crawling around when you go to sleep. Hey guys, Adventure here. And in this video, we'll be taking a look at five of the saddest moments in YouTube videos. Make sure you watch the video until the end to see the saddest clips of Dean TDM and Mr. Beast. These clips are so sad they will make you cry, so don't miss out. At the number five spot, we've got Guava Juice. This clip is super sad. Basically, a few years ago, Guava Juice's family came to visit him in LA from another state. They came for a few days just to see him since they hadn't seen him for a long time. They spent the weekend together enjoying themselves and going to different tourist attractions. But when it was their last day visiting Guava Juice, it was super sad because they didn't want to leave him. Let's check out Guava Juice with his family on their last day visiting him. Keep watching though because when his family leaves, things get really sad and Guava Juice ends up crying a lot. Hi vlog. Hi vlog. Today is the day they go home. But we're in Porto's because my parents are addicted to those cheese rolls that we got yesterday. So they're buying 80 cheese rolls to go back home. So Guava Juice took his family to the airport to drop them off. He didn't want to leave them because he loves his family so much and he barely gets to see them since he's always working really hard on his YouTube channel in LA. As soon as Guava Juice drops his family off, he starts crying a lot. It's really sad to see Guava Juice like this since he's usually a really happy person in his videos. Guava Juice then sits down in his car and reminds his fans how important family is and that you should be grateful if you leave with your family because you never know what's going to happen in the future. Let's check it out. Hey guys. Love y'all. Watch the video until the end for 48 hours of good luck. Next we've got Jacksepticeye. This clip is a really sad one. One day, Jacksepticeye was playing a scary game on a live stream. He saw a note in the game that reminded him of his grandma. Jack's grandma actually ended up passing away a few years ago, so this reminded Jack of the last time he actually saw his grandmother. He starts to get really emotional because the last memory that Jack had of his grandma was a really bad one. He was very close to her when she was alive, so seeing this note really made him cry. Keep watching to see Jack explaining the last time he saw his grandmother. Trust me, it's super sad, so don't miss out. This is sad because it reminds me of the, the last few days when my granny was alive. And she didn't die of cancer or anything, but she she was locked away in like a hospital for the last few months of her life. And she didn't really recognize anybody anymore. She was she was super like aware of everything. Oh God, sorry, that's gonna sound terrible. She was super aware of everything like her entire life and right up until she went into hospital. So Jack then explains the last time that he saw his grandma. He basically said that she'd been sick for months and she'd been in hospital for a long time. On her last days, Jack went and visited her in the hospital with his sister. When they walked into the room, Jack's grandma asked his sister if Jack was going to come and visit. The sad thing was that Jack was right in front of her the whole time, but she completely had forgotten who he actually was. Jack wished he had a more positive final experience with his grandma, but he's grateful that he did get to spend some time with her in the end. Let's check it out. Her mind just completely went. And I remember going in one time with my sister to see her and we were talking to her and my granny was like, is Sean going to come in to visit us? I, I was sitting right next to her and she didn't know who I was. Uh, that was really sad. Again, she didn't die of cancer or anything. It's just reminded me of it. And I need to move on or I won't be able to move on. Next we've got Mr. Beast. Before we get into this one, if you're a fan of Mr. Beast, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe. Also, comment below that you're a fan of Mr. Beast so I know who the real Mr. Beast fans are. I'll be liking and responding to all the comments who say this as well. Anyway, this clip is actually a really positive clip, but there's a really sad part at the end, so make sure you keep watching to see that. So a few years ago, Mr. Beast decided to surprise his mum with $100,000. Mr. Beast's mum really needed this since she had to pay her house's mortgage, so it was really awesome to see. Keep watching to see Mr. Beast give his mum the money and a really sad thing that happened. Trust me, you won't believe it, so don't miss out. Alright, so this is her house. Let us intrude. Hello, Father. What's up? Hey, guys. Hi, Brian. Hi, friends. Oh, hey, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Try not to be too bad at it. More important. 
than you, Mom. I'm sorry, but we need to show our cute dogs. Hey, Princess. Marley. <laughs> you should sit there. As you know, I do lots of videos for quiz. So what do, you, what do you think I got you this time? So when it came time for Mr. Beast to surprise his mum with the $100,000, things got really emotional. Mr. Beast actually started to cry since his mum really deserved the money since she'd done so much for him in his life. Mr. Beast only had 2 million subscribers at the time, compared to the 25 million subscribers he has now. So this was a lot of money for him. His mum didn't want to take the money from him, but Mr. Beast said that she had to take it because all that money was meant for her. This was a very sad but nice clip to see from Mr. Beast. Let's check it out. So, you saw me carrying this, and so I wanted to give you money to put your house or something, don't you have a lot of money in your house? Yes, so I wanted to give you a check to help you pay for it. No. Yeah. Then like, no. quit pay for a little bit of it. You know how much they normally pay, so obviously not all of it, but. No, Jimmy. Yeah. Y'all gonna make me cry. <laughs> TDM. So this clip is probably one of the saddest ones in this whole video. Basically, one day Dan TDM was playing a game called Minecraft Story Mode. Dan's favorite character was a pig named Ruben. This pig was a hero in the game and Dan loved everything about him. But things ended up going really bad and Ruben ended up getting really hurt in the game. Dan got really worried when this happened because he didn't want anything bad happening to his favorite character in the game. Keep watching though because something really sad ends up happening after this and Dan ends up crying a lot. Where's Ruben? I don't even care. Where's Ruben? I don't think you've made it. Ruben! Where's Ruben? I thought he was with you! What? No! Guys, look! The sickness is gone! Oh, that's cool! Okay! Petra! I'm so happy for you! Hey, hey! Please, can you guys hear something? Please! Oh, no! I... I swear! Do not do this to me! After, Ruben got hurt and ended up disappearing. He was now gone and this made Dan cry a lot. Ruben was a hero and was such an awesome character in the game. Dan wishes that this never happened and then after this he had a really hard time playing the rest of the game since he couldn't stop thinking about Ruben. This was definitely a really sad clip from Dan TDM and it really sucked to see him cry about Ruben. Let's check it out. I can't even say anything. we've got Morgs. So this clip is really sad and it's probably the only time that we've seen Morgs actually cry on camera. So a group named Project Zorgo actually ended up breaking into Morgs house one night when he was home alone with his mum. Morgs knew about this group since they had captured other YouTubers before. When he found out they had broken into his house he got really scared because he knew that they were going to take Morgs and his mum. Keep watching though because after this Morgs actually ends up breaking down into tears and crying. This clip is very sad so make sure you don't miss out. What do we do? One more. We moved here because of what happened in the old house. finally realized that they were going to take him and his mum. This made Morgs cry a lot since he was really scared about this happening. There was nothing that he could do in this situation and basically all he could do now was just give up. This was really sad because Morgs is usually a very happy person but in this clip he's so sad because he doesn't know what's going to happen to him. He hacked into the gate. He got into the driveway. He got into the back garden. He's going to break into the house. He's going to kidnap us. There's nothing we can do. Okay, the doors are locked, the windows are shut, there's no way in. 
That's it for five of the saddest moments in YouTube videos. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you're new. This has been Adventure. Peace.